Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Mom, mom, mommy, mom, 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 mama, mommy, 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 mama, 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 mama. Molly, what is going on? What's gotten into you? I have a question. Mom, 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 mom. Okay, what is it, Molly? Um, can I have some ice cream? Molly, no, you know it's right before dinner. Of course you can't have ice cream. But I'm hungry. Molly, dinner is in the oven. It'll be ready in 10 minutes. You can wait that long. No, I can't. I'm starving. Mom, help. Can't wait any longer. Send ice cream. Molly, you're being so dramatic right now. Whoa, Molly, are you okay? What happened? Uh, she wants to eat ice cream for dinner. I'll do CPR. Dad, no, no. You need to send ice cream. I don't need CPR. You look like you might need CPR. Are you dying? Yeah, I'm totally dying without ice cream. It's not fair. I can't eat what I want. Why can't I make my own decisions? Because, Molly, you'd make bad ones. That's why you're a kid and I'm a grown-up. Oh, man. <laughs> look at these adorable dogs. I love this. Dad, um, I can't do my homework. What? Why not? Um, Daisy's watching dog videos on the internet, and um, I need to use the computer for my homework, so guess I don't have to do it tonight. Molly, pff, whatever. You still have to do your homework. Ask Daisy nicely to get off the computer. I'm already off of it, Molly. It's all yours. Nah, I'm just going to skip it. Molly, no, you're not. The answer is no. Go do your homework. Ugh, the answer is always no, it seems. Ay, ay, ay. Something's wrong with the computer. Molly, you just have to learn how to use it. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that funny dog. It's smiling. <laughs> Molly, do your homework already. Family, dinner's ready. Huh, fine. I don't know why we can't eat chocolate ice cream instead. Because, Molly, you can't eat chocolate ice cream for dinner. Can I when we're on vacation? No. But, but it's vacation. Well, who cares? Right now it's not vacation, so just eat the cheeseburger I made you, please. It's delicious. I made it out of a veggie patty. What? <laughs> Ew, vegetables? No way. I love Mom's veggie patties. You would, Daisy. You would. Well, Molly is still eating it. Of course I am. I'm starving. What else is there to eat around here? Molly, could you stop yelling? You're so loud. Yeah, Molly, why don't you take it down just a notch? Ooh, I want to have ice cream for dinner. What? That, oh, 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 that, that's, that's not fair. Actually, it's very fair. <laughs> I'm a grown-up, so I can eat what I want. Dear, we're supposed to be setting a good example. Yeah, set a good example, Dad. Eat a veggie burger instead. Not a chance. I don't like those. They're gross. Hey, I worked hard on this dinner. Okay, bye. I'm going to watch TV. Uh, if only I could live a life like my dad. Mom! 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 Yes, girls? Oh, it's getting very late. You should get to bed. No, actually, Mom, now that we're done with dinner, I was wondering, can we go swimming in the pool? What? N no. It's almost midnight. You can't go swimming in the pool at midnight on a school night. <laughs> Molly, you're asking such crazy questions. What's wrong with you? Daisy, can I see you in the other room, please? What is it, Molly? OMG! Our parents say no to everything! Yeah, you do have a point there, Molly, but that's because you have crazy questions or crazy requests. But they're still my requests! Why do they have to say no to everything? Can they just say yes to one thing? Either ice cream for dinner or no homework or swimming at midnight? No, we can't say yes to anything, Molly! Oh my gosh, this is terrible! Mom! Dad, Daisy and I have decided something. We did? Wait a minute. I didn't know I was a part of this decision. What are we telling them? Wait, I don't want to get in trouble. It was all Molly's fault. 
Okay, girls, what is it? You guys say no to everything. Well, that's not true. We don't say no to you doing your homework, eating healthy. Exactly. Anything that's fun is off limits. I propose that we have one day that's a yes day. Hmm. I don't know, Dan. That doesn't sound like such a bad idea. Whoa, Molly. You kind of had a good idea for once. I know, right? Tomorrow, um, our parents can only say yes. Do you guys agree? Well, as long as it's nothing dangerous. What do you say, Dan? Oh, I don't see why we couldn't do that. All right, tomorrow is a yes day. Okay, well, it's already tomorrow because <laughs> it's almost 2 a.m. What? Go to bed. Tomorrow's school. <laughs> um, no. Tomorrow, I'm not going to school, okay? Oh, all right. Yes, you can stay home. Ha-ha! <laughs> Skip day, skip day, skip day. And also, I'd like to stay up late. It's already late. Go to bed, Molly. Okay, I'll give you that. It is pretty late. But tomorrow, as soon as I wake up, <laughs> everything is a yes. Good morning, parents. Good morning, Molly. You're up pretty early for staying up so late. I'm so excited about today. I don't want the next 24 hours to pass me by while I'm sleeping. Wow, maybe every day we should say yes and get you out of bed on time. Yeah, well, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a mountain of waffles with chocolate ice cream on top. Whoa, <laughs> that sounds super unhealthy, Molly. Oh my gosh, I'm so tired. Yeah, doesn't matter if it's unhealthy. I get to eat it because today is a yes day. So can I have chocolate on top of my waffles? Mm, uh, uh. Okay, yes you can. Ha ha ha! Daisy, you want chocolate on top of your waffle? Absolutely, Molly. I'm still kind of tired. I could use an energy boost. Uh, Daisy, there's no laying on the counter. It's a yes day. You have to say yes and I want to lay on the counter. Okay, yes, I guess you can. Mm. Okay, now I gotta get the waffle. Okay, let's see, I've got the ice cream. Just a little bit of waffle. Mm-hmm. So delicious, waffle, chocolate. Waffle, chocolate. Waffle, chocolate. Waffle, chocolate. Waffle, chocolate. Ugh, I ate too much. <laughs> I'm stuffed. What do we got to drink? Ooh, Bloxier, delicious. Molly, don't forget to shut the refrigerator door. I don't have to. It's not my day to do it. Molly. Uh, Mom, I think you should su shut the refrigerator door. Ugh, Molly, really? Okay, I'll do it since it's a yes day. Daisy, are you ever going to wake up? We have important things to do. Come on, I want to ask you something. Okay, Molly, what is it? Well, so far we've had waffles with ice cream, but maybe we should ask for something bigger. Like what, Molly? Like, what if we borrow Mom's car? What? She's never going to let us do that. She has to. It's a yes day. Oh, Mom! What is it now, Molly? I'm kind of afraid to ask. Can we, um, borrow your car? What? No way! Are you crazy? Uh, Mom, don't forget. It's a yes day. Oh. All right. But be careful, okay? We will! Come on, Daisy! <laughs> I'm going to ride in mom's car. I'm going to ride in mom's car. It's going to be super amazing. Ooh, it's beautiful. Mom's car is so amazing. Yeah, except for she has to get that license plate changed. It still says gaming with Dan on it. Yeah, it's totally not dad's though. It's mom's. He never drives it. Molly, it appears to me that you've never driven it all. Okay, I've never driven this car. I'm having a little bit of trouble with it. Ugh, ugh. Okay, I'm on the road. I'm good. Molly, watch out for that bush. Oh, my goodness. Oh, we got to go over the bridge. Yeah, don't go down into the grass. Let's play some awesome music. P I G G Y. Piggy's after me. P I G G Y. Oh, Piggy, won't you set me free? Molly, you're all over the road. Turn down the music. You're not paying attention. I'm totally paying attention. Molly, you just took out that sign. Molly, what are you doing? Whoa. 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 Oh, my God. Daisy, I just put Mom's car in the pool. 
OMG, Molly! Get out! Get out! Daisy, I can't! My door is stuck! Ah! Daisy! I'm going down with the fishes! Molly, there's no fishes in the pool! Oh my gosh! I'm gonna be the only fish and I can't breathe underwater! Molly, just hang tight! I'll get out an axe! You just carry an axe around? Yeah, for emergencies, of course. Okay, step back, Molly! I don't know about this, Daisy! Molly, what's your alternative? Going to the bottom of the pool forever? Wait, I'm out! Daisy, you did it! Oh my gosh! Molly, how are we gonna tell Mom about our car? Um, well, we could just, like, tell her that, uh... Uh, how can I word it so that she has to say yes that this is okay? Hmm, let me think about this. We could say to her, um... Mom, you're totally fine with us crashing your Jeep into the, po the pool, right? And she'll have to say yes. That's genius! Mom, you have to be okay with us driving your Jeep into the pot. I keep saying pond! Me too, Marty. <laughs> it's pool. Let's practice again. Mom, you're totally cool with me driving your Jeep into the pool, right? Yes, I'm totally cool with it. Ah, this should be fine. Let's go home. Molly, I'm a little nervous. She's going to freak out. I don't think so. I mean, she has to say yes. It's still the yes day. Oh, boy. This might not go as planned. Hey, where's your mom's Jeep? I was going to take that to go over to the grocery store. Oh, uh, mom let us borrow it. Oh, she did? Wait, what? She did? Yeah, she had to say yes. Remember, because it's yes day? Oh, boy. I can't believe she let you drive her prized Jeep. She sure did. Okay, well, bye. Well, wait a minute. You guys are here and the Jeep's not. Where, where is it? Uh, see you later, Dad. Oh, boy. That didn't go so good with Dad, Molly. How do you think it's going to go with Mom? I have no idea, but we're about to find out. Oh, hey, girls. How was your drive in my Jeep? Uh, it was amazing, Mom. Yeah, totally, except for the end. What do you mean, except for the end? <laughs> I didn't hear you girls pull in. Where, Where's the car? Um, uh, Molly, remember what we practiced? Oh, yeah. You're totally okay that I drove your Jeep into the pool, right? What? You what? Oh, my gosh, you drove my... Uh, wait a minute. You, you're kidding, right? <laughs> you're kidding right now, right? <laughs> you're just teasing me, right? You're pranking me? No, Mom, it's a yes day, so you have to be fine that we drove your Jeep into the pool. Wait, you really did drive my Jeep into the pool? Uh, yes? Oh, I don't like yes day anymore. Well, Mom, I can see that you want to take a nap in the kitchen right now, so I know you're really tired from doing the dishes all the time and stuff. Could I have a thousand dollars? What? She's gone insane, Daisy! Well, in her defense, yes day hasn't gone so well for her. Does that mean I can have a thousand dollars? I guess that means yes, since it's a yes day. Thanks, Mom! I got all the cash money! I got all the cash money! Molly, what are you gonna do with that much money anyway? Um... Duh! I'm gonna go to the ice cream store and I'm gonna buy all the ice cream in the world. What? Seriously? <laughs> Don't worry, Mom. I'll bring you back a mint chocolate chip. I know it's your favorite. Okay, sorry. I'm just gonna step over you. Sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah. We might be able to get your Jeep out of the pool later. But first, we're gonna go to the ice cream shop. Whoa. <laughs> There's Mom's Jeep. Oh, well. It was a nice Jeep while we knew it. Molly, she's not going to be happy tomorrow when that um, Jeep isn't out of the pool yet. Well, if she wants it out of the pool, then she needs to work on getting it out of there. Oh, boy. Yeah. Good thing it's a yes day because we'd be grounded otherwise. Wait, why isn't anybody here? I don't know, Molly. Maybe they're on their afternoon break. Okay, well, I'm just going to leave the money right here. I'm going to take all the ice cream. Seriously, Molly? Yep, pretty much. You can start with some bubble gum. Mmm. So good. Then I'm going to have some birthday cake. Mm. So good. Then I'm going to have some mint chocolate chip. Super delicious. Oh, I forgot about the vanilla. Molly, you're going to get a stomach ache. No, I'm not. I dare you. I can eat more ice cream than you. We'll have to see about that one, Molly. Ooh, chocolate. Mm. Mm. So good. 
Maddie, did you read a thousand dollars worth yet? Not even close. Why did we eat all that ice cream? Oh! I know. I'm definitely gonna throw up. Definitely. Oh, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Where's our bathroom? Molly, I don't think there is a bathroom. What? No! Oh! Molly, maybe this yes day wasn't such a good idea. What? Don't talk like that, Daisy. Well, I mean, we drove the Jeep into the pool. We ate too much ice cream. Maybe our parents knew what was good for us all along. What? I'll never, I'll never surrender to that idea. Never! Molly, I think I'm going to be sick. Uh, uh, me too. Uh, so much ice cream! Molly, get off of me! Why are you laying on me? Sorry. I just, I was trying to get to the bathroom so I could bleh. Ew, Molly, gross. I don't want any more yes days. Never again. I don't know what you're talking about, Daisy. I'm going to have a yes day again tomorrow. Well, you could do it alone, Molly. This is just crazy. Bad boys, bad boys. What you going to do? What you going to do when they come for you? Marty, shh, please. I am trying to write an email to the other people in my science fail group. And you're really being loud. Oh, sorry. Mm. These Doritos are good. Now you're crunching too loud. Piggy, piggy. Molly, what are you doing? I'm just sitting here watching cops. No, Molly, I want you to get up and do your chores, please. Please vacuum the floor. But, Mom... I can't move. I'm too full of Doritos. What? Doritos? You're not supposed to be eating those. Go in the kitchen and eat something healthy if you're hungry. Who said anything about being hungry? I just like the taste of Doritos. Molly. Oh, you're killing me here. You're killing me. <laughs> Sorry, Mom. Ugh. Do I really have to vacuum? Yes. Okay. Chores are so lame. Aww. Molly, everyone has to pitch in so that the house is nice and clean and runs smoothly. All I hear you say is blah, 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 blah. Boss Molly around, blah, 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 blah. Oh, you are vacuuming the floor. I was beginning to wonder if you were going to turn into a couch potato. Too late. Oh, could I, could I eat some potato chips, Mom? I'm still kind of hungry. No, of course you can't, Molly. Have an apple. Apple? No way! Molly, you can't just eat bad food all the time. Your body needs healthy things. Ugh. Eat healthy, Molly. Vacuum the floor, Molly. Be quiet, Molly. Can I finally watch my cops episode while eating this apple? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Molly, have you done your homework? Huh? What? Can't hear you. She asked if you've done your homework. Uh, yeah, sure. Molly, if you did your homework, let me see it. Oh, um, uh, okay. Ugh, oh, homework, homework, homework. Where's my homework? Where's my homework? Where's my homework? Where's my homework? Okay, here it is. Here you go, Mom. Molly, this is just a blank piece of paper. There's nothing on it. Oh, um, yeah, well, <laughs> that's just because you can't see it because you have grown-up eyes. Yeah, that's it. It's magical homework. Molly, are you really thinking that I'm going to believe you on this one? She knows you're being ridiculous, Molly. <laughs> Me? Ridiculous? I'm offended that you guys would think I was ridiculous. Of course it's magic homework. Molly, I wasn't born yesterday. This is a blank piece of paper. Do your homework. Wow, snappy. Do your homework right now. Okay, fine. Ugh, my mom is so bossy. She just makes me do stuff all the time that I don't want to do. Hmm, I think I'm going to do the opposite of what my mom says for 24 hours. <laughs> Molly, would you please mop the floor too? My feet are sticking to it. It's really gross. You're supposed to mop. Actually, Daisy's supposed to mop. 
No, I didn't. Um, last week, Molly, it's your turn. Okay, Mom, I'm off the floor. Not. I'm gonna do the opposite of what she says and chill on the couch. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? <laughs> Molly, um, it's time for dinner. Come on, girls. Daisy. Oh, boy. Dinner. What are we having? Pizza? No, we're having a delicious chicken bake with healthy vegetables. Ugh! Sounds miserable. I think it sounds delicious. Of course you would, Daisy. Ugh. I know what to do with this. <laughs> Hi, Coco. Do you want a delicious chicken dinner with vegetables? Here you go. <laughs> you can have all of it. Ugh. Who wants to eat that when you can have a candy bar? <laughs> Molly, are you letting are you letting Coco eat your dinner? Who me? No, never. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna tell mom. Tattletail! You better not! Okay, fine, Molly, but you better not feed that food to the dog. Hmm. Well, this Hershey bar is delicious. And a donut to wash it down. <laughs> Ugh, kind of got a stomach ache. Oh, well, it's still delicious. Molly, did you finish your homework? Yeah, sure, I got it all done. Wait, Mom, where are you? I'm over here. No, you're over there. Wait, wait, where? She's magic. She disappeared. Mom? 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 Molly, what are you doing? <laughs> that was funny. I'm trying to get the laundry done. Would you like to help? Um, Let me think about that for a minute. Uh, eh, uh, eh. No! Oh, Molly, you're so helpful, aren't you? <sighs> okay, why don't you go take a bath? It's almost time for bed. Okay! Bath. <laughs> I'm not taking a bath. Where's a giant mud puddle I can splash in? That sounds like a much better idea. Aren't there any mud puddles in Brookhaven? A, a girl doesn't want to take a bath, unless it's a mud bath. <laughs> I have an idea. Since I have to do the opposite of everything my mom says, I have to get very dirty right now. And I know the perfect place. La 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 la. I'm gonna roll around in the dumpster. <laughs> Wait, where is the dumpster? Oh, there it is. This is going to be epically smelly. Whee! <laughs> Oh, it's thinky in here. Oh, I smell so bad. It's perfect. Wow, the stink is just wafting off of me. <laughs> I am surrounded in a stink cloud. Perfect. Oh, what is that awful smell? It smells like a dead fish mixed with a sewer. Ew. What? I don't know what you're talking about. Hey, you want to switch beds with me tonight? Uh, not really. I like my bed. It's comfortable. <coughs> I can't breathe. Wait a minute. Molly, is that you that smells that way? And you wanted to sleep in my bed? Well, I don't want to make my bed smell bad. Molly, get out of my bed right this instant. Molly, ew. I'm telling mom. You better not. You're a tattletale. Okay, fine. I'll just wear my gas mask and change my sheets. But why don't you take a bath? And what were you doing? Rutting with the pigs? Something like that. Ah, <laughs> oh, what's that smell? Oh, wait. It's still Molly. <laughs> Daisy, come closer. Come closer. Ah, get away from me! Girls, what are you doing? Mom, why are you still standing in front of the washing machine? Because there's so much laundry. I'm still telling another load of it this morning. Wow, you do a lot of laundry. You girls go through a lot of clothes. Ew, what's that smell? Are you wearing the same clothes you did yesterday? Those aren't clean anymore. I know they're not clean. <laughs> Molly, go change right this instant. <coughs> Molly, the bus is here. Molly, oh my goodness. Do you have gym clothes in your bag? Uh, yeah. Just change into those when you get to school so you're not late. Come on, go before you miss the bus. Have a great day, Molly. Don't get detention. Ah, uh, no promises. Mom says I have to get on the bus. There's the bus. But since it's still 24 hours, 
I have to do the exact opposite of what mom says. <laughs> Dad? Oh, hi. Dad, what are you doing? I really didn't want to go to work today, so I'm hiding in the bushes. Dad? Get out of here! This is my hiding space! Okay, Dad. Whatever. You're gonna get fired! Oh, no, I'm just gonna take a personal day. I need to hide from the world. Me too. Well, pick your own hiding spot! And also, you smell terrible. <laughs> Thanks! Ah, another long day of work. Hopefully Molly doesn't get detention. <laughs> Mom's gone. Well, Mom, I can't get detention because I'm not actually at school! <laughs> ah, finally. Now I can watch my favorite show without anybody irritating me! Okay, is Cops not on? Because that will make me sad. Oh yeah, Cops is on. Oh yeah, and eat some Doritos. Gonna chill out. Mm. Doing the opposite of what my mom said for 24 hours was the best decision of my life. <laughs> oh man, I forgot my purse. Molly? What are you doing? Uh-oh. Molly, did you just skip school? Why do you still smell? Why are you eating unhealthy food? Um, well, I was sort of just getting a little sick of you bossing me around all the time, so I decided to do the opposite of what you said for 24 hours. Molly! I tell you these things because I want you to be healthy and successful and a good human being. Oh, you drive me crazy. And to that end, you're grounded for an entire week. What? An entire week? Yes. Now go take a bath so I can drive you to school, Stinky. Oh, man. This opposites thing didn't work out at all. Chop, chop, Molly. Chop, chop. Okay, fine. I could go to school smelly. No way. Hurry. Um, if you're thinking about doing the opposite of what your mom says, here's my advice. Don't! My stomach. Oh, I don't feel good. Oh. Why does my stomach hurt so bad? Oh, Molly. Huh? What? Huh? What's, what's going on? Dizzy, why are you waking me up so early? It's not even 7 o'clock yet. Molly, I need you to come down here, please. Dizzy, what, what's wrong? It's, it's my stomach. It hurts so bad. What? Well, well, did you eat something bad last night? Maybe maybe it's from the bean burritos or something. No, Molly, that's definitely not it. I'm serious. You probably just have to fart. Just try. Okay. Ew, Daisy! Oh, excuse me. Um, yeah, you told me if I fought it, I'd feel better. And it's a lie! My stomach still hurts! Ew, that's super stinky. I have to get back into bed now, Molly. Oh, I can barely stand up. My stomach hurts so bad. Oh. Daisy, are you being serious right now or are you pranking me? Molly, I'm not pranking you. <laughs> I want mom. I don't feel good. Okay, I'll go get mom. Mom, mom, mom. Where are you? Mom, Daisy's really sick. Mom? Oh my gosh, it's Monday morning. Mom told me she had to leave early for work today. She's not even here. Oh my gosh, I have to try to take care of Daisy all by myself. Mom? Mom? Wait, where's Mom? Um, she had to leave early for work today, Daisy. What? No, I need my mom. Daisy, I, I don't know what to do. I don't know either. I just don't feel good. I've never felt so sick in my life. Okay, Daisy. Well, uh, I'll think of something. What should I do? What should I do? What should I do? Wait a minute. If she's that sick, I should probably call an ambulance. 911, what's your emergency? Hi, my name is Molly, and my sister Daisy is having really bad stomach pains. Oh, well, maybe it's just gas, dear. No, it's not gas! She already farted and it didn't make her feel better. Oh, okay, well, does she have any other symptoms? Daisy, do you have any other symptoms? Who are you talking to? 911. 911? No, I don't want to go to the hospital. I'm afraid. 
She says she's afraid and doesn't want to go to the hospital. Well, tell your sister, sometimes going to the hospital is the best thing you can do because they can help you there. I hood hood, I don't care, I want to stay home. Okay, um, my sister's really sick. I don't want her to overhear this, but send an ambulance right away. Okay, dear, thank you for calling. We'll send an ambulance right away. Molly, what are you saying? I'm um, nothing. I, I think you should just rest, okay, Daisy? I have to go get dressed now. Why, Molly? Um, I just do. Oh my gosh. My sister's gonna be so mad when she sees that I, I called an ambulance, but I think she really needs one. Molly, maybe I just need to have said Pepto Bismol. Uh, Daisy, I'm not so sure that that's gonna help. It looks like you're starting to run a fever now, too. Oh, wait, I hear somebody outside. Is that an ambulance I hear? Um, uh, no. Molly, you better not have caught an ambulance. Oh, yeah, she's totally going to be super mad at me about this one. But it's for her own good. Hi there. I'm Paramedic Smith. Uh, where's the patient? She's right this way, but she's really angry that there, there's that person here to take her by ambulance. Okay, well... I work for EMS, so um, I'm just going to see if I can talk her into going to the hospital because it sounds like maybe she needs to go. Yeah, good idea. Daisy, someone's here to see you. It better not be a... Oh, my gosh, it's a paramedic. Oh, my stomach. Okay, sweetheart. All right, Molly, why don't you stand back over there, okay? I'm going to get in and take a look and see what's going on. Okay, Daisy, why don't you tell me what your symptoms are, honey? No, I'm not going to the hospital. Daisy, you don't want to get sick and die, do you? No, not really. Your sister's right. The hospital can help you. We have doctors and specialists there who will know exactly why your stomach hurts so much. And um, you have a pretty high temperature, so I'm going to need to take you in the ambulance. I'll be with you every step of the way, Daisy. Every step. I can't believe you called 911, Molly. Well, what would you have me do, Daisy? I mean, you're sick. You have to go to the hospital. Fine, Molly. Whatever. Daisy, I care about you. I'm really worried. Something is definitely not right. I know, Molly. That's why I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Oh, well, hi there. How can I help you? I'm just waiting for my sister to be wheeled in. She's having horrible stomach pain, doctor. I will take super good care of your sister. What's your name? Molly, and my sister's name is Daisy. Well, don't worry about a thing, Molly. We're going to fix your sister up. Thanks, because I'm really worried about her. Okay, Daisy. Thank you for being the most difficult patient in the entire world. Whatever, paramedic. Just drop me in the bed already. Daisy, no need to be rude. Well, ow, my stomach hurts. I can't help it. Telling you, it's probably just gas, but it's better to check it out. Ugh, that paramedic tried to give me a ride back out into the hall. I told her it wasn't even my break time yet. <laughs> <laughs> Molly, this isn't a laughing matter. Oh, sorry, but your doctor has a good sense of humor. What a great bedside manner you have. Oh, thank you. Okay, Daisy, you have quite a high fever and stomach pain. I'd like to give you an x-ray. I want my mom. Don't worry, Daisy. I already called Mom. She's rushing here right now. Okay, Daisy. I just need you to get right inside the x-ray machine. Excellent. It's really loud in here. Sorry about that. The machine is a little noisy. Okay, Doctor. Tell it to me, so wait. What's happening to me? Am I going to go to the, to the other side? The other side of what? <laughs> the hospital? No way. No, is it? Am I going to die? Oh, wow. Well... I can see exactly what the problem is. What is it? You have appendicitis. Appendo what? I don't want to have a panda in my stomach. Oh no, not a panda. Appendicitis. Yeah, precisely, a panda in my stomach. No, 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 no. Uh, you have something in your body called an appendix. And well, yours is not working right, so we need to take it out. What? I need my appendix! No, you don't need your appendix, really. <laughs> it doesn't really do anything for you, except for be annoying. I don't want to have surgery. This is the worst day of my life. Daisy? Daisy? 
Mommy! <laughs> I was so scared without you. Oh, honey, I'm so sorry, but I'm here now. Everything's going to be okay, I promise. They say I have appendicitis. I know, honey. You are going to have to have your appendix out. I don't want to. That's scary. It's going to be okay, Daisy. I know it is. Easy for you to say. You get to keep your appendicitis. Oh, honey, it's your appendix. Appendix. I want to call it a panda, okay? Okay, Daisy, whatever you say. Oh, look, Daisy, I think they're going to be coming to take you to your surgery now. Mom, I can just stay here. Oh, my stomach! And live with your stomach like this? I don't think so, honey. You need to have this surgery. Everything will be okay. Here comes the doctor now. Okay, time to get that appendix out. Ah! It's Daisy Voorhees! Oh, <laughs> I kid, I kid. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Wow, uh, you really do have a good sense of humor. <laughs> Except for I think this one kind of scared my sister a little. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is crazy town. Okay, Daisy, this might pinch a little, but it's anesthesia, which means you'll fall asleep and you won't feel any of your operation. I don't like shots very much. It'll only hurt for just a second. Ready? Okay. All done. All right. Now you should start counting backwards from 10. Ready? 10, 9, 8, seven, six. Okay, the patient is out. Time to take out her appendix. Molly, what are you doing? I'm just running back and forth. I'm feeling a little bit nervous about Daisy right now. Molly, everything's going to be fine. I promise, honey. Oh my gosh, I hope she's okay. I hope she's okay. I hope she's okay. I hope she's okay. Molly, sit down, please. Okay. Oh, I'm super nervous. Mom, is Daisy going to wake up? Or is she in a coma? No, Molly, she's not in a coma. She's just coming out of anesthesia. Let's go again. Hee hee. Ha ha ha. Hee hee. Why is she laughing hysterically? Um, well, sometimes people do funny things when they're coming out from anesthesia. Daisy, are you awake? I'm gonna eat all the ice creams with pickles on top. <laughs> I'm gonna ride a unicorn through the sky. <laughs> and I like cheese doodles. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I've only got one thing to do. Mmm, this is a delicious cheeseburger. Mm. Sorry, I'm on my lunch break, but... I wanted to come in and tell you guys that, well, everything went well. Great! <laughs> I can't wait to make a video about this. I love unicorns, and I'm going to fly on one, but I eat ice cream with pickles. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> oh, Daisy, <laughs> you are so out of it. It's fabulous. I'm just glad that Daisy is completely okay. Me too! And I'm glad that I can show all the YouTube fans how cray-cray Daisy acts when she's coming out of anesthesia. <laughs> what are you laughing about? I want to laugh too. <laughs> oh, Daisy, you're not going to like this video at all. start getting up early, studying for my tests, doing my chores. If I could just make my brain wake up. Wake up, brain! Wake up! Wake up! One, two, three, four, five, six. Ugh. I haven't worked out in a really long time. I need a cupcake. I need a cupcake! Hey, Mom, good morning! I'm awake super early today, and I'm all dressed for school, and... Oh, seriously? What? What did I do, Mom? What's wrong? Ugh, I just can't believe you woke up at 6 a.m. when you could have woken up at 5 a.m. Wait, what? I never wake up at 6 a.m. So, you could have up, woken up at 5 a.m. and then you could have done more chores. Oh, um, well, we never do chores before school, Mom. I, I have school today. Well, you could have done more studying for that test. I mean, 
When was the last time you actually got a perfect grade on your test? Um, eh, um, well, uh, never. Exactly. Ugh, you could have woken up earlier is my point. I'm sorry, Mom. Um, but, uh, I'll try to do better, okay? You should definitely try to do better. Okay, Mom. Well, I'll, I'll see you after school. Okay, Molly. Bye. Bye! Ugh, I thought my mom would be super proud of me that I woke up at 6 a.m. and got ready, and, and I'm even out here before the school bus gets here. Probably could just walk to school if I wanted to. But no, she's disappointed in me. Again. Mom! Mommy! Mom! Mom! Mama! What, Molly? What is it? Mom! For the first time ever in my entire life, I got a 100 on a test at school. Yes! Oh, Molly, um, this is not what I expected. Oh, no! Don't tell me Mrs. Smith accidentally gave me someone else's test and I actually failed. No, this is your test, Molly, but you only got 100. Wait, say what? I only got 100, Mom, that's a perfect score. No, correction. There was a bonus question on here and you didn't know it. You could have gotten 105. But, but Mom, I got a perfect score. No, perfect would have been 105. Maybe if you had studied harder, gotten up earlier, and done the studying, then you would have gotten a 105. Oh, okay, well, um, I'm sorry that I didn't get a 105, but Mom, for the first time ever, I got 100. This is an insane. I don't care. You need to try harder, Molly. Okay, Mom. I'll try harder. Wow! The entire school is here! Oh. <laughs> Good thing I'm not nervous. Okay, maybe I'm just a little nervous. But I got this. I have been practicing this song for months. And this talent show? I'm totally gonna win it. Yep, that's right, I wrote it myself! And I sang it for the talent show. Thank you. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get first place. Oh, really? I think I'm going to get first place. Pfft, no way. I'm totally going to win it. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Okay, we've narrowed it down to these two contestants, Molly and Mary. Who do you think's going to win? Oh, I can't wait to see. Do you think it's going to be Molly? Boo! Boo! Guacamole! Is my own mother booing me right now? Oh yeah, Molly, that's not a really good sign. <laughs> and the winner is... Mary! Wait, what? But, 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 my song was amazing! Yay! Where's my trophy? I can't wait! Here you go, Mary! <laughs> Congratulations! Oh, man. Mom, I can't believe it! I, I got second place! I worked really hard at this, but you know, second place is still amazing, right, Mom? No, it's not amazing. It's, it's, it's pathetic. Wait, what? If you hadn't taken that breath in the third measure, in the second verse, you would have won. Mom, I had to breathe. I'm human. Breathing is done in a certain way when you're singing. Mom, listen to how I breathe when I sing it. P-I-G-G-Y, Piggy is after me. Then breathe. <gasps> okay, Mom, but I don't have as big as long as you. Lungs as you. I'm not an adult yet. Well, maybe you should have practiced harder. Mom, did you seriously boo me? I did. Mary was the better contestant. Oh, my gosh. You know what? I, 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 I'm tired of trying so hard. I tried to turn over a new leaf, and obviously I'm never going to be good enough for you, Mom. Wait, what? Your high expectations of me is making me feel, well, well, horrible about myself. No, 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 I, I just 
just give up. I'm going back to being lazy and eating Doritos all day and getting the crumbs all over my bed and then sleeping in the crumbs and, and having them stuck to my face in the morning and then eating the crumbs because I'm hungry, but I'm too lazy to go down and get breakfast. Uh, Molly, that sounds really, well, kind of weird. I don't care. I like being lazy. And, 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 and I tried so hard and I'm not good enough for you. Oh my gosh, Molly. I realize that I've been pushing you way too hard. Yes! And you're wonderful and special just the way you are. I'm sorry, sweetheart. I know I've been pushing you way too hard. I I just wanted you to reach your full potential. All it made me do is feel, well, useless and, and like a failure. I just, I never seen you not want to be lazy. And so I, I guess I just went a little crazy. And I'm, I'm sorry, Molly. You know, I don't know if anyone ever told you this, but... Grown-ups aren't perfect either. Really? You're not? Nope. And there's no book that tells us the exact things to do to parent. We just try our best, and sometimes we fail too. Yeah, Mom! You're not meeting my expectations! <laughs> just kidding, Mom. Ah, uh, yeah. I think I did fail in this regard, but I could get you an ice cream and tell you I'm sorry and I love you. Sounds pretty good to me! Can I get two scoops, Mom? Sure, Molly. I've done it! I've done it, people! Done what, Daisy? I've become the smartest human being in the world! Say what? I love this show! Oh man, I hope they always have this on YouTube because this show is the best ever! The brightly colored unicorn, the brightly colored unicorn. Molly! Molly! What, Daisy? I'm busy right now watching new episodes of the Brightly Colored Unicorn. But Molly, I have something I need to tell you and it's really important. I bet it's not, Daisy. It's probably something about having to do schoolwork in the summer or something boring like that. Don't, Molly. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. It's awesome and you're going to love it. Ah, oh, Fine, Daisy. What is it? Ew, Molly, you're kind of stinky. Have you taken a bath yet today? No, I was too busy watching new episodes of the Brightly Colored Unicorn. Ew, Molly, you still have to take a bath. You're stinky. Look at the stink cloud. Daisy, did you just come into my room to tell me I'm stinky? Uh, no, but now that you mentioned it. Okay, get out of my room. No, Molly, I really want to tell you something awesome. Well, if it's go take a bath, that's not very awesome. No, no, no. I saw that they just released a new LOL doll series. Hooray! What? New LOL dolls? Are you serious? I'm totally serious, Molly. Oh my gosh. I have to go see if I have any allowance. Let me look at my desk. Oh, rats. I spent it all on, on candy and stuff. Ooh, Molly. I don't have any money either. I know what we could do. We'll ask Mom. Okay, Molly, but you might want to take a bath first. She'll probably be so distracted by your stinkiness, she won't be able to say yes or no. Okay, Daisy, fine. Sisters, I tell ya. You get a little stinky and they don't want to be your sister anymore. La 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 la. Okay, that's better. I'm not stinky anymore. Ooh, you smell much better, Molly. Okay, I'm gonna go ask Mom now. Hey, Mom! What's up? You look beautiful today. Oh, thank you, Molly. Uh, what do you want? What do you mean, what do I want? I can't just tell my mom she's beautiful. Molly, the only time you give me compliments is usually when you're going to ask me for something that you want. Oh, mom. Not true, not true. Smooth, Molly, smooth. Daisy, shh. Ooh, that looks delicious, mom. I'm starving. Well, I'm just about to um, put all of the stuff on the table and you guys can eat. Sounds good, Mom. Um, I have a question. Okay, Molly, what is it? Um, I was wondering if, um, well, you see, the LOL dolls just came out with a new series, and you know how much I love those. I sure do, Molly. I was wondering if, um, maybe you could give me, like, $15 so I could get it. Oh, I'm sorry, Molly, um, but I already gave you your allowance for this week. I know, but I spent it all, Mom. Oh, I'm sorry, Molly, I don't have any more money to give to you. Mom, yes you do! Okay, Molly, well, you can't have an LOL doll right now. Oh, Mom! <laughs> Ma, 
Molly. No tears. Come on. You know the rules. You can spend your allowance on whatever you want. And I think you chose already that you wanted chocolate and candy, so now you don't have money for the LOL dolls. Ah, <sighs> well, Mom, I'm starving. How about I have a piece of cake? Uh, no, Molly. I just made some healthy chili. You can have that. Woo, chili! I don't want chili! I hate chili! Besides, it makes you fart a lot. Molly, don't be rude. Well, it does. <laughs> Molly! See, even baby Kira knows you go too, too, after you eat chili. Molly, sit down and have something to eat. You're obviously very hungry. You're getting super grumpy. But, Mom, I just wanted some cake, and I wanted LOL dolls. <laughs> Molly, do you need a nap or, or maybe some time out? No, I don't want any of those things. I especially don't want any chili. So ask me if I want to boost my mood. No, I don't want to boost my mood. I want to be grumpy! Molly, just eat your snack and be good. Daisy, I thought you were on my side. We needed an LOL doll. Yeah, but Mom said no. Daisy, oh, fine. Just go in my room. I wonder what would it be like if my mom said yes to everything. Mom, Mom. Well, hello, Molly. What's up, Mom? Um, you look gorgeous today. Thanks, Molly. Is there anything I can give you? Oh, really? You you want to give me stuff? Sure. How about a thousand dollars? A thousand dollars? Are you kidding? I'm rich. Mm -hmm. I heard there's a new LOL doll series out, and you're gonna want to buy all of them. Hmm, now let's see. How many LOL dolls could you buy with that? At least a hundred, Mom. At least. Uh huh. You can just go ahead and um. Grab that right out of my purse. Okay, Mom, thanks. What are you guys doing? Sorry, baby Kira, I have no idea what you said. I don't speak, baby. Mom, I'm a little bored. Well, we'll be going to the store soon so you can buy your stuff, but first I have to make some food because everybody's hungry. Okay, well, I'll just go jump on my bed. Molly, you're not allowed to jump on your bed. Uh, Mom, can I jump on my bed? Sure, Molly, have fun. <laughs> my mom said I could jump on my bed, on my bed. Mom, um, there's all this laundry here. Uh, should we make Daisy do it? Sure, whatever you want, Molly. <laughs> Molly, why are you making me do your laundry? Because Mom said you had to. Get going, Daisy. Get going, get going, get going. Something really weird's going on here. My mom's saying yes to everything. Wait a minute. This is the best day of my life. Mom. Oh, I thought maybe you'd like to eat some cookies. Can I eat all of the cookies, Mom? Um, yeah, sure. You don't think I'll get a tummy ache? Nah, you'll be fine. Oh my gosh. Yum, 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 yum. Okay, Mom. <laughs> oh my gosh, can I even eat all these cookies? Yum, 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 yum. Ah, oh, so many cookies. Molly, could I have a cookie? No. Molly! Mom made all these cookies for me. Oh, yum, 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 yum. Oh, so full. So full. I made you some hot chocolate, Molly. Oh, my gosh. That looks delicious. Glug, 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 glug. One cookie left. Who wants it? Me. <laughs> Yum, 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 yum. Oh, I can't believe I ate the whole thing. Would you like some cake now, Molly? I could make you a cake if you want. No, no, Mom. All oh, those cookies were enough with the hot chocolate and... Oh. I said, oh, Baba, tummy, tummy ache. No, I don't have a tummy ache. I'm fine. Mom, um, can I go swimming in the middle of the night? Sure, Molly. Can I stay up as late as I want? Sure, Molly. <laughs> this is seriously the best day ever. Oh, what are you doing, Daisy? Your laundry, Molly! Ay, 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 this is the worst day ever. Make sure you fold it and put it away in my in my dresser. Whatever, Molly, whatever. Mom! Uh, Molly, um, I was thinking, you know those chores you had to do today? Yeah? Maybe your sisters could handle them. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Girls, why don't you go ahead and get started? 
Silva. Okay, baby Kira, you're a little baby. You don't have to do chores. You don't know how to do them. I can't believe this. Why is mom making me do this? Mom, I don't want to. Sorry, Daisy. It's what Molly wants. Yeah, whatever Molly wants. Ah, best day ever. On second thought, Mom, I think maybe I will have some cake. Okay, Molly, I'm sure you'll love it. Let me get started on it right away. Okay, I'm just gonna go over here and bounce on the bed. Boing, 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 boing. Ah, can you imagine if your mom and dad said yes to everything? Ooh, these cakes look delicious. Ah, oh, my tummy kind of hurts from eating so many cookies. Who cares? Let's eat cake next. This is the worst day of my life. Oh, Daisy, it's okay. Doing my chores is pretty terrible, though, isn't it? Molly, why? Molly, come on. You need to do your chores. Oh, too bad it's not reality. Molly, you could do my chores, too. Yeah, Molly, why don't you help out and do your sister's chores? What? No! That sounds like the worst day ever! Just kidding. You girls need to do your own chores. I did that to Yeah, I did baby. Yeah, you're lucky you're the baby. You don't have to do any of these chores. <sighs> hey, Toy Hero fans. Thanks so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes channel where we put out awesome videos just like this one every single day. Guys, let us know in the comment section below if you think it'd be awesome if your mom or dad said yes to everything. Okay, guys. We'll see you next time. Bye. Oh, yeah. Family life is on. Molly, aren't you going to study for your math test? What? No. Why would I do that? Because, Molly, don't you want to get a good grade and make mom and dad proud of you? Um, uh, uh, not really. Molly, could you stop being a nag? Nag, 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 Okay, fine, whatever, Molly. I'm going to get a great grade, though. Well, congratulations. You're amazing. For the most part, I was very pleased with everyone's test results. I can tell you guys have been doing your homework and studying. There were a few of you though that really need to work harder. Don't know who she's talking about there. <laughs> you, Molly, probably you. What? No, I'm sure I did fine. Molly, you didn't even study for the test. Okay, everyone, I'm gonna be handing the tests out. Let me know if you have any questions. Molly, I really think that you need to work a little bit harder. Um, oh, wow, a 70, I passed. Congratulations, Daisy, you got a 100. Of course she did, who cares? Molly, I went hard for this grade. What are you gonna tell mom when she sees that test, Molly? Um, I was kind of not gonna tell her about it. Let me just stuff it in my pocket. Mom, mom, I got a great grade. Oh, Daisy, there you are. <laughs> Hi, welcome home from school. Hey, Molly. Hey, mom. I got a hundred on my test. Oh, wow, cool. Molly, where's your test? I don't know. I think my unicorn ate it. Molly, you shoved it in your pocket. Uh, Molly, let me see it, please. A 70, huh? Yep, a 70. Passing, right, Mom? Yeah, that is passing, Molly. That's not too bad. I think you did a great job. Wait, what? She didn't even do a homework or study. But she still passed. Now, did you get the bonus problem right, Daisy? Um, no. I, I didn't know that that was going to be a question. It was really hard. Well, I guess you could have gotten a 105 then, right? Always room for improvement. <laughs> I got a 70, that's good enough. But, but, but Molly is a... Uh... Oh, don't worry about Molly. Molly is Molly and Daisy is Daisy. Oh, wow, another episode of Family Life. Ah, life couldn't get any better. Oh, there's my alarm. I should get up because I want to surprise Mom with doing all her chores. Not that Molly would ever do that. She's so lazy. All she does is sleep in. No, I want the purple unicorn. I don't want to ride the pink unicorn. That's not my favorite color. 
Mom's gonna be so excited when she wakes up this morning and I have all of the house clean for her. Ah, then she's gonna love me just as much as she loves Molly. I just know it. But now I have to mop, just make everything so shiny and clean. Good morning, Daisy. It's still kind of early, but it was kind of loud down here. What are you doing? I just did all the chores for Mom, so she would be so happy and less stressed. Did you make me some coffee? Uh, no, Molly. You are on your own. Okay, fine. Mmm, that's pretty good coffee. Good morning, girls. Ooh, Molly, you look tired still. Yeah, I might have to go back to bed for a little bit. I stayed up kind of late playing Roblox. Whoa, everything looks really clean. That's because I cleaned everything, Mom. I got up at 6 a.m. and I vacuumed and I mopped and I did the laundry and I did the dishes. Whoa, you did? That's really nice, thanks. So, Molly, are you still tired? Do you need to go back to bed, honey? But what about me? I did all this cleaning and I did a really good job. Yeah, that's nice. I'm, I'm so glad, Daisy, but look at Molly. Doesn't she look so tired? Do you need more coffee, Molly? Yeah, Mom, way more. Oh, sweetie, I could make you some waffles since you're one of my favorites. What? Did she say that that was her favorite? I can't believe this. No matter what I do, I'm never going to be the favorite or even even remotely like, like one of the loved ones in this family. Like, I just feel like I'm nobody. I'm out of here. So, Molly, do you want peanut butter or do you want butter on your waffle? Uh, Mom, can I have one with butter and one with peanut butter? Of course you can, sweetie. Why don't you go lay on the couch while I make you breakfast? Okay, Mom, thanks. Daisy, come on. We're going to be late for school. Let's go. Daisy? Daisy? Mom, have you seen Daisy? No, I thought she was getting ready with you. No, I thought she was down here, but I don't see her anywhere. Let me try calling her cell phone. It's just ringing and ringing. Wait a minute, I got a message. This number is no longer in service. This number has been disconnected. What? It says Daisy's number's been disconnected. Are you kidding me? W where did she go? I don't know, she's nowhere in the house. Her phone's been turned off. <gasps> Mom, I think she might have run away. Okay, Molly, I'll handle this. You get to school. But Mom... No, Molly, I think you need to go to school. Um, is it okay if I fall asleep? Whatever, Molly. Just try to pass your grades, please. Okay, no promises, though. Man, I hope Daisy's okay. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen. Because nobody loves Daisy. Oh, this sandwich isn't too old. I'll just scrape the mold off of it. Yeah, that'll make a pretty good lunch. Nobody knows the trouble I've seen Cause nobody loves Daisy Is that Daisy? Oh my gosh! Ew, is she eating a moldy sandwich? Daisy, what are you doing? Who are you? I don't even know who you are anymore. Daisy? That's not a nice thing to say to your mom. Mom, I don't have a mom. Daisy, what are you talking about? Why'd you run away? Of course I'm your mom. Are you going to stay in this tent and eat out of the dumpster? Yeah, I'm planning on it since no one loves me. Where did you get the idea that no one loves you? Your dad loves you and Molly loves you and... But you don't, Mom. Molly's your favorite. I know she is. No matter how good my grades are, no matter how many chores I do, no matter what I do, I'm never going to be as good as Molly to you. Daisy, that's not true at all. Yes, it is. She can do no wrong. Molly's definitely your favorite. I heard you even say it in the kitchen. Wait, what? No, I said she's one of my favorites. You're my other favorite and your baby sister too. But, wait, what? Maybe I heard that wrong. You definitely did. Look, each of you are my favorites in your own way. Molly's different than you. Daisy, sometimes I push you hard because I know... You need that. What do you mean? I mean, you love studying and getting good grades, and it means the world to you. I know that you're going to be 
some sort of brainiac someday. A scientist, a doctor, whatever you want, Daisy. But what about Molly? Um, well, Molly has her own career path. I guess you could call it that anyway. <laughs> Wait a minute. So you're just saying that you push me because you love me? That's right, honey. But if you feel too much pressure, I understand. And I won't push you as hard. Oh, I didn't know that was why, Mom. So you just want what's best for me? Of course I do, Daisy. I love you more than anything. Well, I mean, not more than your other sisters or your dad, but I love you all equally. Each of you have a special place in my heart. And how I treat you is how I feel is best for you, just like how I treat Molly is best for her. Okay, Mom, I sort of understand, but um, I have a question. Anything? What is it? Do I still have to eat this moldy sandwich because I'm starving for lunch and my stomach's growling and... Uh, I don't really like moldy sandwiches. Oh, honey, what do you say we both go to Brookhaven Diner? I don't have to go to school? No, you have to go to school, <laughs> but you can have lunch first. Welcome to Brookhaven Diner. What can I get for you, sugar? Ooh, what's that smell? Oh, um, yeah, that would be me. Ugh, yuck, it smells so bad. Well, blame yourself. No one took the trash out of the dumpster. Isn't that part of your job? Uh, yeah, but gross. Well, I was super hungry, so I was looking for a sandwich. Oh my gosh, you poor girl. Are you a homeless orphan? No, she's my daughter. She just had a rough day. Now, we'd like to place our order, please. Oh, sure. Let me read you our specials today. We have liver and onions. Ew, gross. Well, it's better than dumpster sandwich, don't you think? Um, maybe we should just go over and get an ice cream for lunch. No, no, no. I'll, I'll tell you some of my other ones here. I also have sauerkraut sandwiches. Yeah, Mom, let's definitely go for the ice cream. What? What is it, Brookie? I video chatted you to tell you that I am having a party tonight at my house. Seriously? That sounds amazing. Oh, hey, Brookie. Daisy, get out of my room. Sorry, Molly. No can do. Da Daisy wants to be here, too. Why are you talking about yourself like that? Because I, I want to, okay? Guys, don't fight. I know your sisters and all, but you're both invited to my party. Wait, what? A party? Are you serious? Absolutely. <laughs> it's tonight. Oh. What? What's wrong? Yeah, Daisy, what's wrong? Mom's never gonna let us go. Yes, she will. She'll let us go. We'll see about that, Molly. Mom! 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 Uh, what is it, Molly? I'm kind of busy. Oh, I had a long day at the office. See? I don't think she's gonna say yes. A say yes to what, girls? Did you do your homework? Did you do your chores? Uh, Mom, our best friend Brookie is having a party tonight. On a school night? <laughs> That's ridiculous. Okay, yeah, but it sounds like fun. We're gonna watch a movie. Can we please go? We'll be home before 10. Ah, uh, girls, not on a school night. You have homework. I already did my homework. Molly never does her homework, so what's the difference? Hey, I do it, like, once a month. Uh, sure, Molly, sure. Girls, it's a school night. You know the rules. Mom, even if it was a, a Saturday night, you probably wouldn't let us go. Come on. Don't be such a strict mom. Let us go, please. Girls, did you do your chores? Yeah. Did you really, Molly? Yeah, and I can do a few more chores before the party starts even. Just let us go, please. Girls, the answer is no. No parties and no visits at your friend's house on school night. Oh, man. This Molly, uh, you could still do those extra chores, though. Ah! Hey, Molly, what's up? Just video chatting you to tell you a huge surprise. Really? I love surprises. Wait a minute. Did you get me a puppy? <laughs> yeah, right, Molly. Although that would be pretty awesome. No, I'm having a party at my house tonight. I mean, I know it's a school night and stuff. Yeah, my mom will let me come. Seriously? Hey, Daisy. Daisy, why are you in my room? Oh, can we just skip this part, Molly? I come into your room, you get mad, blah, 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 blah. Whatever, you're not supposed to be in my room. Girls, try to get along, okay? Okay, Mom. So, Brookie, uh, what time's the party? 
8 o'clock to 10 o'clock. We're watching an amazing movie. Can I count on you guys being there? We have to ask our mom first. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. She's going to say yes. She always says yes. Well, you guys should definitely ask her first. Okay, but count on us being there. Mom! Mom! What is it, girls? <laughs> I'm just baking this delicious cheesecake for dinner. Seriously, we're having cheesecake for dinner? Well, we're also having some chicken and sweet potatoes, but we could probably have the cheesecake first. Ooh, dessert first. You're the best. Mom, I was wondering, um, can I go to Brookie's house for a party tonight? On a school night? Um, I don't know. Did you girls do your homework? Yeah, I actually did. Me too, Mom, and my chores. Well, as long as you're home by 10 o'clock, I don't see why not. What are you going to do at the party? It sounds so fun. We're going to watch a new movie and eat popcorn. Well, don't get too full on all this cheesecake then. Is this too much cheesecake to eat? Daisy, that's the entire cheesecake. Ooh, it smells so good. I probably could skip popcorn later. Who am I kidding? I'm going to eat all this cheesecake and some popcorn. Whee! <laughs> yeah! Molly, where are you? I'm over here, Daisy. Look at these awesome tricks I just learned. Whoa, move over. I want to try some too. Yeah! Do the backflip. Do the backflip. Girls? Girls, where are you? Girls? <laughs> Whee! Marty, stop doing those backflips. What? Backflips like this one? Molly! Molly, what are you doing? <gasps> Molly, did you just do a backflip on the tr on the on, on the I can't even talk. I'm so upset right now. On the trampoline? Yeah. Isn't it awesome? I learned how to do that. That is so dangerous. Don't ever do that again, or I'm gonna get rid of that. Mom, that's what that's for. You're supposed to jump up and down. Yeah, just up and down, not backflips. Your knee could have come up and, and smacked into your nose, and then your nose would fall off. Uh, Mom, I don't think her nose would fall off. She may get a nosebleed. Yeah, Mom. No, it would definitely fall off. We'd have to go to the ER. They'd have to sew it back on. It would be terrible. Oh, my gosh, Mom. You're such a strict mom. I'm a safe mom. There's a difference. Now go inside and do your chores. Chores? But I want to jump on the trampoline. Chores are boring. Molly, it is time to do chores. Fine. Whee! This trampoline's so fun! Whoa, Molly, you learned a bunch of new tricks on that. You can do a backflip and everything. I know, right? <laughs> I'm awesome on the trampoline. Maybe I'll go to the Olympics. Molly, I don't think there's Olympics for trampoline. No, but gymnastics, and I can be pretty good at that. Girls, girls, where are you? Oh, there you are. Whoa, Molly, did you just do a backflip? Yeah, I totally did. Isn't it awesome? Well, I guess it could be kind of dangerous, right, Mom? No, move over. Let me show you how it's done. Mom? Oh my gosh, mom's amazing. Holy guacamole. Boing, boing. Mom, you are so cool. I know. I try really hard. Maybe after this we could go for ice cream, chocolate, vanilla, or all of the above. Ah, oh, four scoops for me. Me too. Daisy, 6.30. It's time for brightly colored unicorn. The brightly colored unicorn. The brightly colored unicorn. Do, 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 do. OMG, it's a new episode. I'm so excited. Girls, girls, it's time for bed. Time for bed? <laughs> Mom, the sun is still up. Yes, and it's very important for you to get all of your rest. So that way, you're good at school tomorrow. Mom, it is like not even 7 o'clock yet. We can't go to bed yet. I'm not even tired. Well, you're going to have to get tired, Molly, because you need to get your rest. I want you to be the best student you could possibly be. I'm going to be a miserable student if I don't get to watch Brightly Colored Unicorn. It's a brand new episode. Molly, you don't want to be grounded, do you? Oh, man. Well, I got good grades, so I'm staying up late. No, you're not, Daisy. But our friend is outside. She wants us to come out and play. Hey, guys, can you come out? Uh, no, my mom says I have to go to bed. Um, but I'm a big fan. Molly, no fans. You have to go to bed. Okay, let me just say hi. No, Molly. Hi, thanks. Oh, my gosh. My mom's making me go to bed. Can't even talk to fans. She's such a strict mom. I'll be checking in a minute, Molly. You better be sleeping. Now she's making me actually fall asleep. Okay, fine. Molly, 
you think we should go to bed? We've been watching Brightly Colored Unicorn for like hours. And it's 12.30. We have school tomorrow. Oh, I know. But tomorrow's Friday, so it's like the last day of the week. It doesn't even count, does it? Girls, <laughs> you're up late tonight. Mom, where'd you get the cheesecake? There's more in the, free the freezer if you'd want some. Of course, I could pop it in the oven real quick. OMG! Is that the stuff that you got that from that special food truck? Yeah, they make it homemade, and then they freeze it, and then you can buy it, and it's so good! Holy guacamole. Girls, um, so are you tired? Do you, do you want to go to bed? Nah, I think I'm good for another episode. Besides, tomorrow's Friday at school. Hmm, this does look like I got a, a good episode. Shove over so I can watch, too. Mom, you're so cool that you watch Brightly Colored Unicorn. Yeah, she really is. Well, who wants cheesecake? I do! Me, be! <laughs> we have the coolest mom ever. <sighs> I'm probably going to be tired tomorrow, though. Oh, look at my little sister. She's so adorable. Do, 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 do. Baby Kira, so cute. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I woke her up. Oopsie. Sorry, baby Carrie. You can go back to sleep. Yeah, I don't want you. Ah! Oh my gosh, I was just saying you were so cute. And now I've sort of changed my mind because you're not being cute. Molly, did you wake up baby Kira? Not on purpose. I was just looking in on her because she looked so cute. And I guess I sang a little too loud. I wasn't trying to. And then I woke her up. Molly, you can't wake up the baby. I, yay, yay. I just got her down for a nap. Oh, Mom, I didn't mean to. Molly, why don't you go do your laundry? Laundry? I don't I don't want to. Too bad, Molly. Get going. Oh, laundry. I hate doing laundry. So annoying. Stinky and 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 gross and I don't like it. Daisy, I want you to stop watching TV and I need you to go um like sweep and, and, and dust and stuff. I don't want to, Mom. I'm watching this news. This is really interesting. Stop bad advertising. Uh, Daisy, there's nothing interesting about that. But the monkeys got out of the zoo again. What? The monkeys got out of the zoo? Hopefully there's no school. They're probably all at school again. Yeah, right, Molly. All right, girls, get going. Oh, boy. I don't feel like doing chores. Yeah, me either. Ugh, always doing chores. Don't you know we need some downtime after school? Girls, you're doing online school right now. How much downtime do you need? A lot, Mom. A lot. Ma, Molly, Mom is being so demanding lately. Eh, it's probably because she has to deal with us, do our online schooling with us, still has to work, take care of the baby, make dinner, get groceries, clean the house. And it's a lot on a Mom. I know, but cheap was creepers. Ugh, when this laundry's done, I'm gonna go play on my computer. It's gonna be so fun. Come on, laundry, hurry up! Ugh, this laundry takes forever. Fold, 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 done. La, 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 la. Wow, that song is awful, Daisy. <laughs> Molly, that's not nice to say. Well, just speaking the truth. Whatever, Molly, I'm gonna be a vlog star. La, 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 la. Just like Mom. Oh, yeah. My new channel, So Geeky, is doing really good on YouTube. I'm so excited. Yeah, you should be, Mom. You're a great musician. Thank you, Molly. Now, wait a minute. What do you want? Can't I just pay my mom a compliment? Mm, doesn't sound like you, Molly. Well, I'm just trying to be nice. Go put away your clothes, Molly. Uh-huh, yep, and then I'm going to play a game. What did you say, Molly? Nothing. Hopefully, she doesn't even notice me. Ah, now it's time to play some ping pong. La 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 la. This is so much fun! Molly, what are you doing? You have to study for your science test. What? No, I can do that later. I need a little downtime. Molly, you know you have to study first, then downtime. It doesn't even make sense, Mom. I need the downtime! Ooh, Molly, that game looks fun! Daisy, you need to go study, study for your science test. I already studied for an owl. Well, better make it two so you get a good grade. Oh, man! Wow, I'm really tired of Mom bossing us around all the time. I mean, she is our mom, but whatever. She, she can't boss us around. Actually, Daisy, yes, she can. She's our mom. 
Well, I, I don't want to bless this around for the rest of the day. Boy, I need a vacation. Me too. I wish mom had laryngitis. What? Why, why do you wish that? Is where you lose your voice, then she can't tell us what to do. I wish mom had laryngitis. <laughs> Whoa. I feel kind of... I feel kind of weird. Uh, I feel kind of... <laughs> Mom, why are you imitating the monkeys that got out of the zoo? Yeah, Mom, what are you doing? <laughs> oh my gosh, Daisy. I think our wish came true. <laughs> oh no, no, it had nothing to do with you, Mom. We didn't wish anything about you. No, 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 no. Well, it looks like you can't tell us what to do today, Mom, so we're going to go outside and play. See you later. See you, Mom. Hope you feel better. Maybe some uh, tea will help that uh, laryngitis you got there. Ah! Oh, Daisy, it's snowing. <laughs> I love when it snows. Whee! This is so much fun. Oh, this is so much fun. Woo! Mom can't tell us what to do. Mom can't tell us what to do. Well... Yeah, that's true. She can't tell us what to do. I wonder how long this will last, though. What were you going to say, Molly? You said, well... Well, I was thinking maybe she could write it down on a piece of paper and then hand it to us. Oh, that's bad news. Don't say that, Molly. Hopefully she doesn't think of that. Yeah, she definitely won't, right? I don't know. She's pretty smart. She better not think of that. Wee! Wee! Oh, I want to go in the swings, too, Molly. What, Mom? We can't understand a word you're saying. I know, aren't those so adorable? Oh, we've got an octopus, a teddy bear, a unicorn. Mom, you just sound like a crazy monkey. I don't know what to tell you right now. I'm gonna go swimming. Molly, I don't think you can. It's too cold. The water's not frozen. Whoa! But I am. I am. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Freezing, 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 freezing. Okay, I gotta go sit by the fire. Uh, uh, uh. Molly, I'm starving. Maybe mom will make us something for lunch. Yeah, let's go ask her. Mom! Mom! Where are you? Mom? <coughs> mom, you should get inside. You're sick with laryngitis, you know. <coughs> you do sound like a crazy monkey. Mom, could you make me something for lunch? <coughs> um, I can't understand what you're saying. Molly, we, we don't know what she's saying, so we don't think she could make us lunch. Um, Mom, um, I don't know what you're saying right now, but I really want some lunch, okay? Okay, whatever you say, Mom. Oh, I'm going to go get in the hot tub. Get warmed up after being in that freezing cold pool. Ah, this is a life. No chores, no school, no homework. <laughs> I wonder if my lunch is ready yet. Hey, Mom, is lunch ready? <laughs> Mom, you sound so bad. Uh, Molly, this is what Mom decided. Mom, yuck! <laughs> Molly, I think she's trying to say she couldn't ask us what we wanted, so we get this green slime. Oh, oh it's gross, Mom. Yuck! <laughs> Maybe you should eat some green slime. It might make you feel better. Oh, oh, Mom, don't cry. I'm sure your laryngitis will get better in shortly anyway. Um, Mom, I was wondering um, if you could drive me to the mall because my friends are going to be hanging out there later. Uh, what? She's sick, I think, is she saying, Molly, so she can't leave. What? No, you're not sick, Mom. It was just a wish. I mean... Yeah, you're sick, but you can still drive us. Oh, my gosh. Daisy, can I see you in my room for a minute? What is it, Molly? Isn't this great? Mom has laryngitis. Not really. Did you see the lunch we got? It wasn't even edible. Yeah, that's true. And now she can't take me to the mall because she's sick? Daisy, we have to undo this wish. But then she'll make us do chores and homework. I know, but Daisy, we can't go to the mall. Your favorite place in the entire world. Yeah, that is true. Okay, Molly, let's do this. I wish Mom was healthy again. No laryngitis. <laughs> oh, 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 my gosh. I got my voice back. Oh, thank goodness, girls. 
girls, there's lots of chores to do. Oh, brother, she's back to telling us we need chores. <laughs> well, that's what moms do, I guess. That's what moms do. Girls, it's time to get up. Come on, you're going to be late for school. Oh, no, I'm not going to school today. Tell them, tell them I, I quit. Molly, <laughs> don't be ridiculous. Come on, Daisy, you're usually out of bed. No, not today. She doesn't want to get up today. No, I'm not getting up ever again. I'm so tired. Oh, is it summer yet? What's wrong with you girls? You've been this way all week. Come on, get out of bed. No, can't, can't. Oh, okay, fine. I'm going to go get your mom, and she'll probably have a bucket of water, and she'll dump it right on your head. <laughs> Good one, Dad. Good one. Daisy, I dare you not to move. I dare you not to move. Dare accepted. <laughs> Girls, time to wake up. Time to wake up. Come on, chop, chop, out of bed. Mom, I'm so tired. So many months of school. Yeah, Mom. Is it summer yet? No, girls. You still have another month or so of school before summer vacation. Now get out of bed, please. Nope. Can't do it. Oh, my gosh. Here I come with a bucket of water. I don't care. I'll just have a water bed. <laughs> really? Ugh. You girls are so frustrating. They won't get out of bed for me either. Wait, what? This is like... How many days in a row now that they won't get out of bed for school? This is so unlike Daisy. Yeah, I mean, Molly's always been kind of a troublemaker when it comes to going to school, but not Daisy. Uh, I don't know what to do, Laura. These girls have got to get to school. Hmm, I have an idea. Come here, Dan, and I'll whisper it to you. Okay. Really? You want to try that? I definitely do. This is going to work. Come on, follow me. <whistles> Molly, we should probably get out of bed now. Ooh, what now? I'm thinking all day I can sleep in here. Molly, it's like one o'clock. We have to get up. Besides, uh, I won the deal because um, I stayed in bed the longest. What? No, you didn't. See, you got out of your bed. But you're already out of your bed. Whatever, Molly. We both know I'm the winner. No, you're not. Whatever. I'm going to go get some cereal. Ah, We didn't have to go to school. This was fabulous. Molly, wait for me. Oh, you took the elevator before I could get down there. Hey, wait a minute. Where, where's Mom and Dad? I don't know. Maybe they're in their office or something. I didn't see them in their office. O-M-G! We have the whole house to ourselves! Mmm. That's very good. Mmm. Molly, you're actually eating an apple? Yeah, I am because I'm so hungry. Molly, there's waffles in here. You should eat that. Mmm. Mmm. Yum. Molly, I kind of want to go to school now. I mean, I don't want to be late and get detention again tomorrow. Well, you're already late, Daisy. It's like one in the afternoon. Yeah, but click, 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 click. Um, I, I'm gonna get detention, and I, I don't want to. Well, you're already late. Yeah, but if I don't show up at all, then I'll definitely get detention. <sighs> Fine, I'll call mom and see where she is, and see if she'll drive us to school. It's ringing. Well, Molly, what, what did she pick up? No, she didn't answer. Let me try her number again. Oh my gosh, Daisy! It, 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 it's making the noise that her phone is disconnected! But try dad, try dad. Oh yeah, good idea. Is it Geek? No! His phone is saying disconnected too! What? Our parents? Did they, did they abandon us? <laughs> Don't be silly, Daisy. Don't be silly. But Molly, 
we, we've been so naughty and we haven't gotten out of bed for school. And, and, and now they're not here and the phone is disconnected. When have they ever just left us and not made us get up for school? Wow, you're right, Daisy. I'm going to go to their room and see if their suitcases are there. Good idea, Molly. Good idea. Daisy, you check the bathrooms. Why, Molly? Because Dad had enchiladas for dinner last night and he might be in there. <laughs> Molly, I don't think so. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to check in their closet or their dresser or whatever. See if their suitcases are there. What? Their, their suitcases are are missing. Yeah, and Dad's not in the bathroom either. Okay, let me check the family safe. OMG! There's only $100 left in here. <gasps> Molly, they took the rest of the money and left. Her parents <laughs> abandoned us. It's all because we were being naughty and wouldn't get out of bed for school. <laughs> Daisy, don't panic. This could be good. I mean, we could do this. We could, we could be adults, right? No, Molly, you're the worst adult on the planet. You never get out of bed to your chores or your homework. And you don't even have a job. We can't even afford Eggo Waffles anymore. <laughs> okay, think, Molly, think, think, think. How can I get Mom and Dad to come back? I made a mistake. I made a mistake. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh. Okay, I'll just turn on the TV and watch that. That'll help. What? The TV won't turn on? Oh my god, our parents didn't pay the cable bill! Molly, this is terrible! <laughs> oh my gosh, freaking out, freaking out, freaking out, freaking out, freaking out! Parents abandoned us! We are all alone! Molly? Molly? Are you okay? No. I can't, I can't adult! I can't adult! Molly, seriously, step out of it! Can't adult! Molly, I can't do this alone! Come back to me! Molly, breathe! Breathe! Oh, Daisy, I see the light! Molly, no! <laughs> Girls, oh, <laughs> there you are! Mom, you're back! I, I, I didn't know where you were! Um, uh, Molly, are you okay? Molly? Yeah, <laughs> uh, fine. Where were you guys today? We, we knew you were coming back. Yep, totally. Your mom and I just didn't want to deal with being an adult anymore, so we went and got ice cream. Yeah, it was super fun. What? We thought you abandoned us and you had ice cream all day? Well, since you didn't want to get out of bed and you were being such brats, we decided we were going to take the day off. OMG, Daisy! Well, you have to admit, Molly, we kind of deserved that. Ugh, parents are, are crazy! Well, Molly, <laughs> are you going to start getting out of bed on time? Uh, Molly? Yeah, but can we get ice cream with you guys too? If you manage to get out of bed for school for one whole week on time, then I will buy you any ice cream cone you want. Okay, sounds like a deal, Mom. Just don't ever abandon us, okay? Never, Molly. Never. Ah, this is a life. I'm going to stay home from school today because I need a day to just relax. <laughs> Molly, what are you talking about? You can't stay home from school. You're not sick, are you? Yeah, I'm sick of school. Molly, rude! School is very important. It teaches you very, very important things. Yeah, but does it teach me how to sit on the couch, relax, and watch Brooke High? So, let me get this straight. You don't want to go to school, but you want to stay home and watch a show about school? Yeah, exactly. I'll never understand you, Molly. Girls, come on. Come on in the kitchen. You need to have breakfast. Ooh, breakfast! Daisy, I got a new backpack, and it's adorable! You also got new braces. Yeah, don't remind me. I don't even want to think about that right now. Don't worry, Molly. Everyone's going to love your new braces. I'm sure of it. Mom, I want a waffle. Okay, Molly, you can have a waffle. Mmm, mm, these are delicious, Mom. Thanks for getting those. Molly, you could eat something healthy like a banana. Do I look like a monkey to you? Uh, well... Girls, try to be nice to each other. I'm not saying you have to always be nice, but you could at least try. 
Oh, she's my sister, though. She's so annoying. Tell me about it. You're annoying, too. No time for fighting today, girls. I have a very important today. And I have to get out of here, like, right now. So I need you girls to get to school. Wow, sounds like a really important day at work, Mom. It sure is. Uh, yeah, important day at work. Yeah, that's it. Mom, what kind of special things do you have to do at work? <laughs> um, mm, work day stuff. Uh-huh, yeah, that's it. Work, work day stuff. Okay, uh, get going, girls. I don't want you to be late for school, especially since you're walking there. Wow, did, um, you notice that Mom was acting kind of weird? I did notice that. What was that all about? I don't know. I'm going to go ask Dad. Dad! Dad! What, what's... Why is Mom acting so weird? Huh? What? <laughs> I wasn't looking at those cute dog videos. I was totally just... Yeah, okay, I was. Dad, aren't you supposed to be logging into work right now? Yeah, but work's just been so, well, annoying lately. That's exactly how I feel about school. Molly, school and work are not the same thing. I don't see how they are. I mean, both of them make you do a bunch of stuff you don't want to do. Well, that's not true. Normally, I really like my job, but this time of year, it's just really stressful. Yeah, I can see that, Dad. <laughs> that's why we should both just have like a chill out and watch TV kind of day. We could order a pizza. Sorry, Molly. No can do. I have to be the grown up here and tell you, get to school. Dad, I thought you were on my side. Sorry, Molly. Not this time. Oh, man. School is so boring. Molly, you like school. Well, are you coming or not, Daisy Cheapers? You're being so slow. Sorry, Molly. Where's your backpack? Oh, I forgot my backpack. You better go get it or you'll get detention and it would end your life. Molly, don't be so dramatic. Well, you've never had detention. I think um, it would. It would make you go crazy if you actually had detention. Now me, I'm a detention expert. Seriously, you're going to take that backpack? I love this backpack. It's adorable. Daisy, I don't think we should go to school today. What are you talking about? Come on. No, seriously, Daisy. Something really weird's going on with Mom. You think so? Yeah, I think we should follow her. Molly, that's a terrible idea. Come on, we still have an hour before school starts. We could follow her and see what she's doing. Okay, Molly, as long as we get to school on time. Besides, she's probably doing something boring, like at being at work. She's not at work, I'm telling you. Something very, very fishy is going on here. Well, let's take the scooter, Molly. It's much faster than walking. Great idea. So excited you got this. It's so cool. It is pretty cool, Molly. I love it. Okay, well, let's head to Mom's work first and see if she's there. Good idea, Molly, but I'm telling you, she's going to be there. Getting off. Molly, wait till I stop. Holy guacamole. Wait, what? Where's Mom? She's not at the front desk where she's supposed to be. She's probably just in the bathroom. Uh, no, she's supposed to be here until someone covers for her. That way, if someone comes in, like us, there's someone to answer. Okay, wait, I'm going to check and see if Mom has actually checked in. Daisy, it says Mom's never checked in today. Holy guacamole, where could she be? I don't know, but we have to get to the bottom of this. Hey, Daisy, lo look at that. It's Mom's car. Holy guacamole, let's follow her. Uh, Daisy, you might want to get off the sidewalk. Oopsie, still learning how to drive. Is Mom... What? Is mom in the hair and nail salon? Sure looks like it, Molly. Holy guacamole. She's not at work at all. She's relaxing at the hair salon. And that whole speech she gives me every day about making sure I go to school and doing my work. She's not even doing hers. Well, maybe she's just stopping in there real quick before work. We'll see about that. Come on. Let's go hide around the corner and watch what she does. Ah, Molly, we can't be late for school. Don't worry, Daisy. We won't be late for school. La, 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 la. Oh, I feel so beautiful. Oh, this looks fun. Where's she going? It looks like she went into the office building. Get right, Daisy. That's the arcade down there. OMG. 
Maybe she got a second job at the arcade. Nah, she wouldn't do that, would she? Maybe, Molly. You know, she might need to buy us birthday presents. Oh, really, Daisy? Look at her. What? What is it? Oh, she's playing video games instead of being at work. Okay, we definitely need to spy on her um, some more. Let's go in here and hide. Molly, why are you hiding behind the ice cream? Um, no reason. Molly, you're eating the ice cream. Ooh, birthday cake is delicious. Oh, brother. Hmm, where do I want to go next? The ice cream shop. Oh my gosh, mom's coming in here, quick. There, no one will know it's me. Me either. Molly, look at your disguise. All you did was draw onto paper. That's a terrible disguise. Okay, I, I tried my best, okay? I didn't have sunglasses. And, and where'd you get a fake mustache from? No, Will, Molly. I just have a bunch of random things in my backpack. Well, I don't. So this disguise will have to work. Ooh, ice cream. <laughs> oh, my me day is going so well. <clears throat> oh, hello. What can I get for you today? Wow, you two remind me of somebody. <laughs> Probably not, though. <laughs> No, we couldn't remind you of anybody you know. What do you want? Ooh, root service. I'll have to leave that in a Google review. Oh, sorry. We didn't mean it. What would you like today? I'll have a chocolate ice cream cone, please. So, what are you up to today? Well, I was supposed to be at work, but I decided to take a me day. Every now and again, I just need one of those. Ha! Busted! You aren't at work at all! What? M Molly? That's right, and Daisy, too. Wait a minute, why aren't you girls at school? Same reason you're not at work. Well, actually, not the same reason. You're just goofing off. We're trying to catch you goofing off. Yeah, Mom, so disappointed. Well, but I, work's been really hard lately, and I just, I needed a little downtime, okay? Um, no, not okay. Mm, this ice cream's good. Wait, you got ice cream, too? Why aren't you at school? We were trying to follow you to see what you were doing since you acted so weird today. Girls, you need to get to school. But mom, you're not at work. Well, grown-ups get to do that sometimes. It's called a personal day. A personal day? I don't get any personal days. Well, you do have the entire summer off. She has a point there, Molly. But what about during the school year? When the school year just drags on and on and on. Well, I guess you'll have to dream of summer. Now get to school. Uh, are you going to go to work? No. I'm going to go play more games at the arcade and eat some more ice cream. Have a good day, girls. What? That doesn't seem fair. Well, look at it this way, Molly. When we grow up, we could do whatever we want to. Uh, I can't wait to be a grown-up. Roll over, you're snoring so loud. Huh, what? Uh, sorry. Laura, seriously, why are you snoring so loud? Ugh, I never met a girl who could snore as loud as you can. Uh, sorry, Ugh, my stomach is just really hurting. Oh, you probably have to fart. Just go back to sleep. Oh, I think I have to go to the bathroom. Ugh, I don't feel so good. Oh, I hope you're going to be okay. Thanks, Dan. Ugh. Ugh, I'm definitely going to throw up. Ugh. Ugh, gross. I hate throwing up. Ugh. I don't feel so good. Laura, are you okay in there? Are you throwing up? Oh, she definitely got the stomach bug. Gross. Laura, it's okay. I'll bring you the Pepto-Bismol. Poor thing. Aw. I'll be right there. I mixed it with some ice cream so it tastes better because Pepto-Bismol tastes awful. Laura, can I come in? Okay, you didn't answer. Here I come. <laughs> Laura? Laura? Oh my gosh, what happened? Laura? Are you alive? Ah! Uh... Okay, yeah, she's alive. She's moaning. Oh my gosh, she fainted. Okay, I'm calling 911. 911, what's your emergency? My wife, she was puking a lot, and I went to make her an ice cream pe Pepto Bismol smoothie, and when I came back, she was laying on the floor. She had passed out. I thought she was dead, but no, she moaned, so she's not dead. 
Okay, first of all, you should never feed someone ice cream and Pepto-Bismol when they don't feel good. Okay, yeah, but who cares about that? Second of all, I have dispatched a ambulance to your house. We know exactly where your cell phone location is. <laughs> it's so crazy, right? Technology. Are you going to be here soon? I'm really worried. Yes, we'll be there soon. Laura, everything's going to be okay, I promise. The paramedics are on their way. Uh, uh, uh. I think she may have thrown up way too many times. I'm not really sure, though, what's going on. I hope she doesn't die. I love her a whole lot. Except for when she snores so bad in bed. Okay, sir. Everything's going to be fine. Hello, paramedic. Oh, my gosh. You guys got here so quick. Oh, my. Okay, let's see what the trouble is. Ma'am, can you hear me? Ma'am? Oh, I can hear you. My stomach just hurts, and then I got really dizzy. Oh, wow, ma'am. Well, I'm going to put you on the stretcher and take you in the ambulance to the hospital, okay? Do you remember your name? Yeah, it's Laura. Okay, Laura. Everything's going to be okay. All right, sir. Uh, you might want to get off the stretcher. Sorry, I'm just really nervous and kind of tired. I'll go out here and wait. Dan, why are you getting on my stretcher? Sorry. <laughs> Oops. All right, Laura. I'm just going to put you on the stretcher now. Everything's going to be okay. You're the nicest paramedic ever. Thank you so much. No problem, honey. Everything's going to be all right. Let's go get you into the ambulance. Would you like to come along, husband? Absolutely. Uh, I'll even go in my pajamas. I don't care. I don't know what happened. I, I was fine. I was sleeping, and my husband woke me up and said, You're snoring too loud. And my stomach got upset, and I ran into the bathroom to throw up, and I fainted. It's okay, ma'am. We're going to take you to the hospital, and they'll find out what's going on. We, we didn't pick up my husband. He'll have to meet us there. This is an emergency. Laura, are you still with me? Yeah, I'm just feeling really faint again. Oh, and my stomach really hurts. It's going to be okay, honey. I'm going to take good care of you. Come on. Let's get you, get you into a room so a doctor can see you. Hi there, Laura, is it? Yeah. I, I, I don't feel very good. Well, I'm Dr. Nickenbacher, and I will be taking care of you today. I just want my husband. Is he here yet? Uh, he should be on his way. I'm right here, honey. Sorry, you guys left without me. I just had to get my slippers. I came as soon as I could. I ran the whole way. You didn't take the car? Well, I mean, I ran to the car, and then I ran from the car to the emergency room door. That's what I bet. <laughs> I'm way too lazy to run all the way to the hospital. You know that. Yeah, I know. Oh, my stomach. Well, the first thing I think we should do with your wife is get an x-ray of her entire body because we have no idea what's going on. Most especially her brain and her stomach since she fainted and her stomach hurts. That sounds like a good plan. I'm so worried about her. All right, I'll send in a stretcher for you and I'll meet you in the x-ray room. Oh, this won't hurt, will it? No, x-rays are painless, although they can be a little noisy. How long will this take? Um, well, if I don't hit myself with the door. <laughs> About till right now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay, wow. Um, that's an interesting find. What, what is it? Am I dying? I'm gonna send in the nurse to bring you back on the stretcher, and we'll have this conversation with your husband. Really? Really? I'm gonna die, aren't I? That's why he needs to be there. Uh, I wouldn't say that. I'll see you back in your room, Laura. What is it? What's happening? Let's wait for your wife to get back. This is the type of news I want to tell you together. Oh my god, she's dying! I knew it! Just calm down, Mr. Smith. Everything's going to be okay. Okay, Mr. and Mrs. Smith, I reviewed your wife's x-rays, and this is going to come as a bit of a shock to you. I knew it! She's dying! I don't know how I'll ever say goodbye to you, Dan. Okay, Mr. and Mrs. Dramatic, she's not dying. She's actually, well, pregnant. Wait, what? Pregnant? Oh my gosh, I can't believe it! This is a little shocking and crazy. Yeah, and the crazy part is, is you guys are having, um, triplets. Triplets? What? Oh. Mr. Smith? Now you're the one that fainted. Mr. Smith, are you okay? Okay. I just need a minute here on the floor to just catch my breath. 
Okay. Are you okay, Mrs. Smith? I... I can't believe it. Pregnant with triplets? When... When am I due? When am I going to have my baby? Babies? <laughs> I mean, I still have to have, like, a baby shower and get cribs and... Well, that's just the thing. I've never seen this before in my career as a doctor, but... You're going to give birth any minute. Wait, what? Okay, I'm just going to stay down here on the floor because I can't move. I... <sighs> Dan, I need your support. I can't believe it. I'm going to... Ah, my stomach hurts. Ah. Okay, honey. We got this. I mean, right? We do have this, right? You guys totally got it. Let me go put my iPad down. Sounds like I'm going to deliver three little babies. I've never seen this in my career before. This is going to be crazy. All right, let me change into my scrubs. What an amazing day this is going to be. Okay, let's do this. Wait, you, you already had one of the babies? Yeah. Oh, my gosh, it was crazy. Oh, you didn't wait for me. Oh, I wanted to deliver the baby. Okay, well, she had one. What do you want me to say? Oh, but here comes another. Here, Dan, hold the first baby. What am I supposed to do with it? Just be nice to her while I deliver baby number two. Okay, Laura, deep breath. Doctor, why are you laying down? Sorry, it's been a long shift. I didn't mean to lay down. Are you sleeping standing up? I don't know if I really am okay with you delivering these babies right now. You're being a little crazy. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me just lay down for a minute. Okay, I'm good. I took a one-minute nap, so I'm fine. All right, let's deliver that second baby. Great job, Laura. She's beautiful. Okay, choose enough. We don't need the third one. She, can, she doesn't have to come. She can stay. Sorry, that's not the way it works, Mr. Smith. You're having three babies. Oh, she's adorable. Hi, sweet little girl. I know. Mine's adorable, too. They're both adorable, and we still have one more. I'm going to be poor. I'm totally going to be poor. Three girls? Trips to the malls? Oh, my gosh. I'm done for. Hi, Dr. Nickenbacker. What can I do for you? Whoa! You have twins? No. Identical triplets. Oh, my gosh. Okay, take the second baby because Laura's about to have the third. Okay, no problem. All right, Laura, deep breath. Are you seriously laying down again? Sorry, I'm just really tired. This is like a lot of excitement. I am a really good doctor though, I promise. Well then stand up and help me give birth to this baby. Okay, yeah, yeah, sorry. All right, you're doing great, Laura. Oh my gosh, honey, you had three babies. Get out of my bed, Dr. Knickerbocker. <sighs> okay, well, my shift's just about over, and these babies look adorable and healthy. Congratulations. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe it. Today has been the craziest day of my entire existence. Tell me about it. But look at our adorable babies. Oh, so sweet. Now all we have to decide is what we're going to name them. Hey guys, if you have names that would be perfect for our trip list, let us know in the comment section below because Laura and I have to come up with three adorable names for our sweet little girls. And we want to know what you guys would name your triplets. Okay guys, thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye guys! Oh, it's been such a long day. But look at the beautiful babies I got out of it! <laughs> I'm so happy. Mom! Mom! Where are you? Where's my snack? I'm starving! It's after school, you know. There's supposed to be a snack. Hey, Toy Hero fans. It's Toy Hero Laura. Whoa. Where's that sound coming from? So today I'm going to tell you about my crazy life with three crazy kids. Mom life. Mom? Are you on my computer? Mom, what are you doing? Say hi to the Toy Hero fans, Molly. Mom, why are you on my computer recording a video for the Toy Heroes channel? Um, because I'm a Toy Hero and sometimes I record um, videos for it. Okay, but what are you what are you even going to record a video about? Mom life. Mom life? What's that all about? 
Watch the video and you'll find out, Molly. It's all about my life as a mom with three crazy kids. Hey, Mom, I'm not crazy. Molly, I think you kind of are. No, I'm not. Boing, 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 boing. That's exactly what I'm talking about. Mom, are you filming this? Totally, Molly. Oh, my goodness, Mom. Are you going to film our entire day? Yep, and it's going to show just how crazy my life is with you kids. All right, Toy Hero fans, I have got on my cam on um, my shirt, and so I, it can follow me everywhere I go today. Oh, boy, I better be on my best behavior then. That's right, Molly. Okay, Mom, the first thing you need to do in your crazy mom life is make me a snack, okay? It's after school, you know. <sighs> okay, come on, Toy Hero fans. Let me show you how crazy my day gets. Well, half a day, because it's after school. Okay, half a day, Molly. <sighs> but that's enough, trust me. All right, how about something healthy? Healthy? No, I don't want anything healthy. I just don't know if it's a unicorn. What are you guys watching? Oh, the brightly colored unicorn, the brightly colored unicorn. Uh, make room, I want to sit here. Just don't know if it's a unicorn, it's a unicorn too. What she said, Molly, is there's not enough room for you. Hey, I want to sit here too, make room. Molly, stop stepping on me. Girls, behave please. Here you go, here's some snacks. Ugh, what's this salad? Blech. Can't we have a cupcake? No, Molly. Molly, get out of the way, I can't see the brightly colored unicorn. Cease. Ugh, okay, fine. I'm so glad you got up, because now I can sit in that seat. Girls, are you fighting again? No, there's nothing to fight about. I just don't know about my snack, snack, I don't know about I don't know about my snack. Eww, I don't know about my yeah, that's what I said, too. Ew, where's the cupcakes? Mom, where's the cupcakes? Molly, you don't get any cupcakes today. What? Why? Because you need to eat healthy some of the time. But, Mom, I don't want to. And, girls, it's time to do your homework. Oh, Buado, I've got so much homework. I don't even want to get started. Molly! <laughs> Boo! Boo! It's like a spooky house. I like a spooky house. Oh, gosh. It's right about now that I start to feel like I need a vacation. Without us, Mom, you'd miss us so much. Oh, I don't know, Molly. A vacation all by myself sounds kind of nice. Mom, just say you'd miss us. Molly, get out of the sink. <laughs> say it, Mom. Say it. You know, Molly, I totally miss you. Even though we, you have three crazy kids? Absolutely. Now go get started on your homework, please. Okay. Molly, that's not the way to your room. I just wanted to make sure Daisy was actually doing her homework. You just worry about you, Molly. One plus two is three. Three plus three is six. Six plus six is twelve. Ugh, math homework. My least favorite. Boing, 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 boing. Whee! <laughs> Doing nothing. <laughs> boing 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 boing. Molly, what are you doing? Oh, you're such a little monkey. I can't help it, Mom. I've got so much energy. Uh, 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 uh. See what happens when you eat healthy food? I jump on everything. That's right, Molly. <laughs> you have tons of energy. I just don't for me to Oh, the baby's crying because she can't find her passy. Ew, yeah, she's also crying because P.U., she has a stinky diaper. Do, 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 poo, poo. <laughs> Mom, she says she has poo-poo in her diaper. Okay, baby Kira, I'll be right there. I'm just doing the dishes, and then I'll change your diaper. I don't suppose that you want to change your little sister's diaper, do you, Molly? Um, nope, got tons of homework. Yeah, now you want to do your homework. Yeah, I sure do, Mom, definitely, yep. Definitely want to do my homework. Oh, I love this game. I just don't put my new diaper, new diaper. <laughs> my little sister's running all over. Baby Kira, come back here. Oh, my goodness. Now she locked the door. What's going on, Mom? Go do your homework, Molly. Where's baby Kira? 
Ugh, she locked the door in this in the laundry room. She doesn't want to have her diaper changed. Baby Kira, come out here. You gotta have your diaper changed. I said you don't put it down. You don't know you don't put it down. I said you don't put it down. You don't put it down. Ugh, I wish I understood baby talk. I understood it perfectly. She said no. All that to just say no? Yeah, baby talk's a lot different than what we talk. Baby Kira, come on, come on out. It's no use. She locked the door. Watch this, Mom. Baby Kira, do you want a cupcake? Cupcake, cupcake, <laughs> cupcake. Okay, come on, let's go. Let's go get a cupcake. Come on, come with me. Come on, baby Kira. I said to die, I to buy it. I told him be the dad you papa. Okay, mom, come on, I locked her in. Papa, you put the twit. Sorry about that, baby Kira. Molly, you get back to doing your homework. And thank you. No problem, mom. Anytime. Now maybe she'll let me play this game instead of doing my homework. <laughs> do, 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 do. I love Roblox, yes I do. I love Roblox, how about you? If you love Roblox, slam that like button. Molly, what are you doing? That's not your homework. Uh, yeah, Mrs. Harris wants us to play these games all night. Molly, are you lying to me right now? No, we're supposed to play games all night. No, but not Molly. Uh, Molly, go stand in timeout. Mom, no. Molly, five minutes in timeout. Oh. See, Toy Hero fans, this is what I'm talking about. Craziest day ever with three crazy kids. Hashtag mom life. Mom, can I get out of timeout? No. Mom, can I get out of timeout? No. How about now? No. How about now? No, no, and no. If you ask again, you'll have to stand there for another five minutes. Oh, man. Mom's being super tough today. Guess I better actually do my chores and my homework. Mom, is the time up? Yes, Molly, your time's up. Oh, thank goodness. Do your chores, Molly. Fine, Mom, I'll do my chores. Oh, there's always so many chores. Ew, this laundry smells horrible. Mom! Yes, Molly? Oh, I'm trying to make dinner. My homework's done except for this problem, Mom, which I don't know if I can answer. Okay, Daisy, what is it? Molly, get off of the table. I just don't go by Zabby, Papa. But, Mom, this laundry smells so bad. It stinks, stinky, pee pee, you. Because I don't play a giant, do ba bling, 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 bling. Oh, my gosh. Right for three kids. Oh. Mom, doesn't this make you want to have about three more? Um, nope. Uh, I think I'm good with three. <laughs> Mom, you love us. I do love you girls, even though you're my three crazy kids. When's Dad going to be home? Any minute, girls. Any minute. Okay, Daisy, what's that problem? It's 12 plus 10. Oof, that one's a hard one. Okay, well, why don't you count it out? Laundry, laundry, stinky laundry. Laundry, laundry, stinky laundry. Hey, baby Kira, you want to earn a quarter? <laughs> okay, here, do my laundry, okay? Okay. <laughs> You stay here and do my laundry. Wow, Molly, that was fast. You finished all of your chores? I sure did. Where's baby Kira? Uh, I don't know. She's just probably playing in the living room, being quiet and good. Um, There's never a time when baby Kira is just being quiet. No, don't even go in there, Mom. <laughs> She's not doing anything. Baby Kira, come here, please. I did all the laundry. Molly, are you making your sister do your your homework and your laundry? No, not my homework. She's a baby, Mom. She she wouldn't understand. Okay, are you having her do your laundry? Uh, well, uh, back to timeout, Molly. Mom! And this is my life with three crazy kids. Oh, timeout. Oh, this is the worst. See you in five minutes, Molly.